also just endorsed by Republican Susan Ford Bales. Middle name is important there. She is the daughter of former Republican President Gerald Ford and a lifelong Republican. On mainstream economic issues, which Pundit World is always telling us is the bedrock of all normal election politicking, last week we talked about The Economist magazine going large this past week with its special report on the rip-roaring economy that the Biden-Harris administration is leaving in its wake. The Economist calling it literally the envy of the world. The U.S. economy, after this four years of Biden and Harris, outpacing every other major industrialized economy in the world, blowing all economic expectations out of the water on growth, on the job market, on taming inflation, on wages, on manufacturing jobs, on household wealth for average American households. On top of that, entities like the Wall Street Journal now reporting on the fairly devastating economic expectations from Trump's policies. Economists telling the journal in overwhelming numbers that Trump's policies will be terrible for inflation, terrible for the deficit, terrible for interest rates. Today, you can add Social Security to that list. A new report from a nonpartisan fiscal watchdog group setting off the alarm that what Trump is proposing economically will destroy Social Security within six years. Will end Social Security within six years.